Well, howdy, friends. We're back. We're back from the grave down under. How are you? What? We, we've done that joke before. The grave down under? No. Okay, not that part. Anyway, whatever. What part? You're confusing me. Never mind. What part are you talking about, man? Then we're back from the grave. Well, we are. We have to go back there again. I have to say hello to my great great uncle. Oh my god, Matt. <laughs> Wait, when is the Day of the Dead? Is that May? November. November? That's October Cinco de Mayo. I'm thinking Cinco de Mayo. Oh, shit. No, um, no, what's the Day of the Dead? Yeah, no, Cinco de Mayo is the 5th of May. Yeah, 5th of May. Yeah. No, Day of the Dead is when is the Mexican celebration for... Uh, yeah, celebrating the dead. Rem yeah, remembering family who've passed on and such. That's October 31st, the 1st of November, the 2nd of November. Oh, okay. It's a three-day affair. Lovely. So, yeah, welcome back, folks. We've been gone for a short bit. Mm -hmm. And, uh, we're back! Yep. And the reason we've been gone for a while is we ran into kind of a big technical issue. How about you tell them about that, Matt? Oh, uh, yeah. See, we've been recording on my old PS3. Ah, oh, she was a beaut, eh? Got her back in 2007. She was one of the fat boys, if you will. Fat girl. Whatever. Anyway. The big model PS3. Yeah, and this was the model that was backwards compatible. It could play the PS1, the PS2, and it had four USB ports. It was a powerful bastard she was. Jesus Christ. But... After time and time of going through airports, being stripped apart because people at the airport thought she was evil, but she wasn't, and moving to like three, maybe four locations in her lifetime, mm. she finally died. Yeah. Yellow light of death. Yeah. Now, granted, we tried to fix it using like reflowing and. Oh, that, yeah, we that's got it. A, yeah, reflowing. We got a white room. Nice. Yeah. We actually didn't have any of those. Anyway, uh, point is, yeah, we tried to reflow, reball, all kinds of stuff. Tried to make it work again, but... Yeah, we got it working for a little bit, but then it just ended up dying again. So, she's been laid the rest. We have a, one of the more recent uh, PS3 model PS3s here now. The one with the slide opening. Ech. Which Matt has... Mixed feelings about, but yeah. it does the job. Yeah, exactly. Plus, at least the CDs won't get caught, uh, the game discs won't get caught inside it anymore. Yeah, I remember that was my first complaint when the PS3 came out. Because I remember, oh, what was it? The PS2 I had, the very first one was that big fat one as well. Mm -hmm. So it was much like a CD drive on an old computer. Yeah. <laughs> Coming in and out. Yeah. But then I had that flip lid thing, which I liked. Yeah. Because exactly what we just said, what if the thing dies and you won't get the disc out? Then you have to pay someone a bunch of money to get it out of there. Yeah. Or a hammer. Hammer? A hammer and being very careful. Or as you break your disc. Uh, yeah. I mean, I still have the old PS3. She's in storage. And on occasion, I've gone back to try to fix her a few times, but I'll leave that for a later date. I mean, I pretty much have everything I need. I mean, all my save data is backed up. Yeah, it is now, anyway. Via cloud. Yeah. Unfortunately, in the case of this game, we didn't have that enabled, so we had to go back and um, replay a bit. So, if it seems we're not in the exact place we were, although we kind of are, uh, well, that's why. But, yeah. So, that's just the update for y'all to know what happened in between behind the scenes. And we're back where we should be. Yep. yep. Well, more or less. Yep. So, here we are. I'm playing, and it's been a while since I played any of this, so... You're doing good, though. You're doing good. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I should be doing all right. Ooh. Yeah. Take that, Shadow! Ha <laughs> ha! I am the ultimate... Hey, I got a trophy for you. Got it. a trophy. Something. Don't know what, though. Interceptor, you probably countered something at the... Maybe you countered a hundred things at the right no. time. I don't know. Ugh. That's a guess. Hmm. It might be the trophy achievements guy, but I don't memorize them. Yeah. I just look at the list and like, okay, what can I do today? Anyway, let's go on to plot. 
as we said in the last one, let's go to cards we don't want. What do we don't want? Uh, green cards. Green card! Red card! Mm, they move uh, slower. Yeah, that one. Oh, no, that has to be one card, no, accumulatively. Um, there was a nine on there. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Okay. Just check them. Oops, why'd I do that? Nah, d don't feel bad. I did that once during our Let's Play of this. Hey, right, here we go, folks. <coughs> let's, let's, let's see what's next. Into the light. You're not dead, though. Yep. What are we? Oh! What? Th that, that was something I remember I was talking to you about. Ugh. The afterlife? No, 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 no. It, it was something I thought of recently. Which is? Where, um... Okay, so you were playing some games, or maybe movies. I'm trying to remember what this was rooted to. But I kind of thought to myself, because some people were arguing, like, what is the whole lore behind Majora's Mask? Oh, yeah? And I don't remember who said it, but one person did give off the theory that maybe the entire Termina field and the whole ordeal is actually just a dream slash afterlife mm. and young link died when he fell down that hole mm. chasing after majora mm. and th th there was this conversation i was having with you earlier today that that mind kind of came up to me saying like some of these like games and movies and stuff mm -hmm. like I, i'm pretty sure it's not the case but when you have like an average character in a normal world yeah. and they're suddenly thrown in this fantasy world yeah what if they're not actually thrown into a fantasy world, but what if they're dead? And then suddenly they're thrown into, like, this weird, demented actor-life thing. Mm. It is a good theory. It would fit with the, um, theory that people had where the game is also about the five stages of uh, grief. Which <laughs> is, like, gr well, five stages of acceptance. That's what I meant to say. Five stages of acceptance, where it's, like, rage, yeah. grief... And then finally, at the end of it, acceptance. Yeah. And coming I mean, to terms with things. Because I wasn't sure if I was thinking about a movie or a game mm. around that principle. Because I was talking about something, and when I thought about it, I was like, oh, that's kind of sad. Mm -hmm. But also, if that was true in a way, then it makes almost whatever it was I was thinking of pointless. Yeah. It's like, oh, well, if it's a dream and it's not real, or whatever, maybe... <laughs> What's the point of investing in this story? Exactly. That also um, brings up a... Oh! Yay. We have a higher jump now. Yeah. Nice. Um, anyway. Um, right. That's also a good um, connection to one of my personal favorite movies, uh, Pan's Labyrinth. Oh, uh, yeah. Because um, with the uh, costume designer thing, you know... Well, you've seen it, I'm sure. Yeah. yeah. Um... In the end, though, it comes to kind of a thing where it's like when... Spoiler for anyone who hasn't seen that movie at all. Um, when her stepfather, the girl... When her stepfather shoots her and she dies... Oh, yeah, that happened. There's that scene that happens where she's in... Technically, shows her in, like, that mystical uh, fairy world... Meaning her quote unquote real father and everything, who was supposed to be the king because she was the spirit of his daughter incarnate into a human or whatever. Mm -hmm. And it's just that moment of like, is this actually happening? Because after that, there's the scene of her mother in the real world holding her dead body and crying over her and everything and there's that whole conundrum there yeah like which one's real or are they both real or is that the illusion that's her version of the afterlife yeah and it's very interesting and it kind of ties in what, what you said there when he falls down the hole yeah well, and I, it has all the mystic shit happen well i think for pan's labyrinth that's a bit more obvious because mm -hmm. i mean that sounds like something that would happen yeah. In the after but I'm like talking about like ones where you're like watching movies or playing games and the character trips or Oh yeah yeah. Gets hit for a second or just falls asleep and then mm -hmm. all of a sudden crazy stuff happens afterwards. Yeah. That's kinda like when I started thinking to myself, maybe they're dead. And all this crazy stuff. Because I know I was thinking about this recently when I was mm -hmm. watching something. The, the most <clears throat> recent thing I was watching was House of Cards, but I don't think that's the case. Mm. Because then weird stuff would happen in that. Yeah, and that <laughs> one's pretty... Uh, pretty grounded. Grounded, yeah. Yeah. 
but uh, I don't know. Maybe it was an anime I was thinking of that originally brought this up because I remember. Maybe I was over there and you were over there, and that's when I was thinking it for a split second. Oh, we were talking about something. I don't know what. Yeah, I don't. Rem we listed off a bunch of anime we used to watch. It could have been any of those, or it could have been just in general. I don't know. Hmm. Case in point, so we, considering I remember this from Kingdom Hearts 1, are we about to get t attacked by the intestinal worm, or...? I have no idea, who cares? I guess yeah, so. Yeah, we are, okay. Yay, the parasite! That's what happens when you skip events. Yeah, well, we're, they're not here for story, they're here to listen to our very entertaining stories. Wait, you just sit... God damn it, Matt. <laughs> oh, what's that thing? Ooh. Oh. That's a bit different. Yeah, I remember this fight. It was yeah, fight. it wasn't like this though. Mm. It wasn't on a platform in the middle, and mm. I mean it's not a problem, but ah, oh, no follow up. Oh, yeah, uh, uh, oh, wait, what's the jump? Circle. Ah, oh, god, dang it! I was pressing it, I wasn't doing anything. Well, don't worry, I healed myself, and I don't get hurt that way. Why am I over there? Because Cloud's a derp and thought that'd be a good place to stand. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, well, oh, right. I just realized I am facing a boss. Shh. Uh, no, 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 it's fine. It takes away the first card permanently. That's not what I meant. Oh, what? You use both potions. Yeah, but it'll come back when I recharge. Oh, all right. Oh, nice. You knocked them out a little. So, remind me, in Kingdom Hearts 1, because they recolored a Heartless in the main games, yeah. wasn't he, like, yellow? This yeah, box? in the remix, right? Yeah. Well, that's I believe I so. Uh, no, he was green. Oh, he was green? They made him green. Would you... Gosh, I can't... Uh, of course he broke it with a zero. Oh, well. Oh. Uh, uh, I gotta recharge. Uh... Uh, uh, X. I. I uh, you. How did he break a six with a three? I didn't see what happened. Well then, I wasn't really prepared for a boss fight. <laughs> so, yeah, to be honest, I didn't. Well, then again, all those heart doors do lead the the end hmm. of each world. Wait, I thought it was three doors. Yeah, we went through. We the went through the doors. second one. I Just get. on this episode. I guess so. I mean, you open the heart door. When you go through the heart door, that's it. Oh. That was my problem. Oh, okay. Uh, I guess we'll have to continue this later. No, no, no we're fine. Keep going. Uh, uh, we're not done yet. All right, you know, I'm going to level up. Though. Yeah, no, do that. Open that door. Oh, okay, there's a thing there. Never mind. Kill uh -huh. that. Sorry about that, folks. That's all right. Like I said, we just started replaying this game again, so... Yeah, I can't believe we were that close to a boss fight. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know that I... Yeah. Like I said, I always thought it was like, you have to go through two golden rooms, and the third room will always be the boss. Well, we did. But we I... went through three. Don't... I don't remember either when we went through three. Don't get me wrong in thinking I'm saying we did, and I remember I don't. Ooh, that was beautiful. That was. But... Yeah, apparently we did. Hmm. Well, don't I feel like a peach on a fuzzy farm? Well, okay. I guess we'll have to level up a little bit and try again on the next episode. Sure. Uh, to be continued, then. We'll have to continue this later. Sci-fi!